An international team of researchers led by Swinburne University of Technology has demonstrated the world's fastest and most powerful optical neuromorphic processor for artificial intelligence AI, which operates faster than 10 trillion operations per second tera OPs, S, and is capable of processing. Published in the journal Nature, this breakthrough represents an enormous leap forward for neural networks and neuromorphic processing in general. Artificial neural networks, a key form of AI, can learn and perform complex operations with wide applications to computer vision, natural language processing, facial recognition, speech translation, playing strategy games, medical diagnosis and many other areas. Inspired by the biological structure of the brain's visual cortex system, artificial neural networks extract key features of raw data to predict properties and behavior with unprecedented accuracy and simplicity. Led by Swinburne's Professor David Moss, Dr. Zingyuan, Mike Xu, Swinburne, Monash University and distinguished Professor Arnon Mitchell from RMIT University, the team achieved an exceptional feat in optical neural networks, dramatically accelerating their computing speed and processing power. The team demonstrated an optical neuromorphic processor operating more than 1,000 times faster than any previous processor, with the system also processing record-sized ultra-large-scale images, enough to achieve full facial image recognition, something that other optical processors have been una. This breakthrough was achieved with optical microcombs, as was our world record Internet data speed reported in May 2020, says Professor Moss, director of Swinburne's Optical Sciences Center and recently named one of Australia's top research leaders in physics and mathematics in the field of opti. While state-of-the-art electronic processors such as the Google TPU can operate beyond 100 tera OPs, s, this is done with tens of thousands of parallel processors. In contrast, the optical system demonstrated by the team uses a single processor and was achieved using a new technique of simultaneously interleaving the data in time, wavelength and spatial dimensions through an integrated micro-comb source. Micro-combs are relatively new devices that act like a rainbow made up of hundreds of high-quality infrared lasers on a single chip. They are much faster, smaller, lighter and cheaper than any other optical source. In the 10 years since I co-invented them, integrated micro-comb chips have become enormously important and it is truly exciting to see them enabling these huge advances in information communication and processing. Micro-combs offer enormous promise for us to meet the world's insatiable need for information, Professor Moss says. This processor can serve as a universal ultra-high bandwidth front end for any neuromorphic hardware, optical or electronic based, bringing massive data machine learning for real-time ultra-high bandwidth data within reach, says co-lead author of the study, Dr. Xu, Swinburne alum and postdoctor. We're currently getting a sneak peek of how the processors of the future will look. It's really showing us how dramatically we can scale the power of our processors through the innovative use of microcombs, Dr. Xu explains. RMIT's Professor Mitchell adds, this technology is applicable to all forms of processing and communications, it will have a huge impact. Long term we hope to realize fully integrated systems on a chip, greatly reducing cost and energy consumption. Convolutional neural networks have been central to the artificial intelligence revolution, but existing silicon technology increasingly presents a bottleneck in processing speed and n. Please support my channel to grow by pressing subscribe button and the bell icon, we will notify you technological news. Thank you.